Hello, my name is Cory, and in this video, I'd like to show you how to create a Go Animate video that can be used as a supplementary materials in our lessons. And before we go to how to create that, I'd like to show you a part of the video that my partner Zue and I have created, and this video will be used for our lesson. Okay, so this is the video. Okay, so the sound is not really clear in the video, but actually there is a conversation made between the man and the woman. So the first thing you need to do to create this video is you go to go animate do go animate dot com. Okay. So this is how the page looks like. So the first thing you need to do, if you don't have an account, you have to create an account first. In here, you see there's a your account, and then you create one. Since my partner has got an account, so let's go to his account here. And once you have an account, you will have this uh, for the layout, and you will have an option make, make a video. Let's click on that, and then there will be some options, some kinds of cartoons that you can use for your um, video. There will be some of them like this or this, comedy word, little piece, common draft, and whatever. And there will be some more here, lot, okay. And for the previous video, we used this. Comedy word. Okay. Now, once you click on that, you'll have this thing. And if you need a tutorial, you can click on this. But if you don't like this pop up, comes up. So you can click on this. But I would just ignore it by skipping that. Okay. And you will have some options for the background of the video. What we used here is a classroom background it's not really classroom it's a meeting room actually but we made it as a classroom background so let me find it okay this is the conference room that we use as a classroom background because the class in our university it really looks like this and there are some things that you can move it around like the door, you can move it up here, okay, and then you can make it open like this. That's what we do, and you also can move the chairs, okay. But we didn't do that. And the next step you might need is to get the people, okay. As you can see, there are some items here for the, this is the background, the characters, okay, and if you need a text bubble, you can use that, or if you want to use the sound as a background, you also can use that. But this time, let's put a character. The previous character is the supervisor. We chose this lady, okay, and then you can click on her and move it anywhere. And this is where we did, uh, where we put her previously in the video. And we didn't have the man, right, in the first scene. Okay, so, as the lady there, you can choose the emotion. Okay, like, what kind of emotion? Is it excited, or sad, or love, or just basic? So we choose a basic one, and, but we need to think of the expression of her face. And we choose the happy face okay, to greet the, the man, right? Okay, that's the first thing. And then, 
I need to go to the second scene. I use copy and then click on the plus. And you'll get the exact same scene from the previous one, from number one. Okay, what you need to do is, of course, make some change from the previous one. The first change we made is that there is a man here. Okay, Raj. So we move Raj there, a little bit there. If you think you want to make it. can see it like this. Okay. And we want Raj to face the professor, right? So you click on this one, flip. See? Now he's facing the professor. Okay. So now um, the prof we want the professor to say something to Raj. Um, what was that before? Good morning, Raj, right? So what we do is you click on the dialogue and then make recording. So you use a microphone to record your voice. That's what we did. Or you also can upload your file if you think you have some good um, source to use in the video. Or you also can use text to speech. This one is interesting because you can choose the gender, the nationality, and the name. So there will be some different voices that you can use. And you just type what you want to say in the video. Okay. But we didn't do that in the video. So I just skipped that one. You can try that if you want. And then, for the next one, don't forget to copy and then add. It means you have the same scene as the previous one, right? Okay. Now, let me try to add some sound by recording my own voice. But I have to st stop for a while, right? Okay. I'd like to make sure that I can do this, the screen capture at the same time. Let's see. Okay. So when you press on the recording you will have something like this and then you can start record your voice okay and there will be number good morning raj that's what i did now you can play it okay or if you think that's enough then you can add it okay now your video your the draft has got this sound wave under the picture. Okay? And you can see the length, the duration of the scene that you have. This one is quite long, so you can make it shorter by dragging it and slide it and move it a little bit. Okay? And you need to make sure that when the lady is saying something, the the man is not saying anything that's that's our video but if, if you can if you want to make it like they speak at the same time then you can do it all right so for the next scene because it has got exactly the same effects from the previous um uh, scene then you might need to change it okay the first one is of course the lady doesn't say anything Okay, but looks happy. Oh, wait, the first, the second one. Yeah. Alright. Okay, I need to make sure that he is not only happy, but he talks. So, let's change the expression. In the second scene, we use talk happy. Okay, so he's, she's talking, but she expresses some happy feeling. Alright, for the third scene... We want this lady not to say anything. See, because this one is copied from the previous one, it doesn't have the talk happy. Okay, so just happy and put some effects on the man. Uh, this time, uh, the man needs to be happy too, talk happy. Okay, you can 
change some other emotions, apply some other emotions here. Not always so happy. Okay, and then what we did is, of course, record our voice. But because the way is not here, so let's let me do that. Good morning, Professor G. Okay, that's what we did. Look at the loading bar. All right. So make sure that you don't have too long scene with a short dialogue, which is gonna be awkward. It will be too long, too long pose. So make it more uh, concise and. You need to keep tracking the change, whether you need to change something else or not, by using preview. Okay, let's let's. Okay, so there's something with the pre the very first scene. It seems it's too long, so let's make it really short. And this one is a bit shorter too. Let's do it again. Okay. So once you think that's enough, you can do save now and write the title G1 and you can change the uh, privacy, whether it's private or public um, because we're going to use it for the students so we want to publish it. You use public, save and share. Okay. If you want to share it, you can do that. You can use this uh, URL address or you can use uh, some other social media. But if you just want to save it, you also can do that. And what we did is just link it to the URL address. So the students can access that and watch that. Okay, I think um, that's the tips. Not the tutorial to make the video and that's what we did with our video i hope it's going to be helpful and be creative see ya